Hello everyone, my name is Alex and I'm one of the product specialists here at Laser Lines. In today's video we're going to show you how easy it is to use Form 3 3D printer by Formlabs. The Form 3 is powered by low force stereo lithography. This technology uses a precisely controlled linear illumination for accuracy and repeatability and a flexible tank to turn liquid resin into a 3D printed part like the one we have here. The flexible tank reduces forces while sprinting, which gives great surface finish with a few supports, like the part we have over here. As you can see, the edges are quite sharp and you have very good fine details. So let's get started with the process. We'll go over to the computer to prep the parts into preform. We'll open the rock head that we're looking at printing. Now we'll go into the support to generate support. The touch points can also be edited. So if you press edit, you can zoom in and you can see some of the touch points there on the sharp corners, sharp edges. If you want to move that, you just highlight it and move it away. When you're happy with all the touch points that have been moved from the edges, if you don't want any support in that area, you can just press apply and the support has been generated. From here, the print is ready to go. Go into the printer, we'll upload the job, and now it's being sent to the printer. Okay, so our part has been set up into the preform. We've sent it to the printer. So what we'll do next, we're just gonna walk into the printer. The part should be waiting there in the queue for us to ready and start printing. As you can see, our print is ready here. It also has gone into the queue, so all you have to do is select it, press print, open the vent cap, which we already have. Next, ensure hand handle is locked, which it is. Confirm, and now the print has been prepared. Okay, so our parts are now ready. We're just gonna walk over to the printer to remove the parts. So what we'll do next is open the door, Put the clamp up, pick the build platform and slide it out. So in the next process, we're gonna go into the form wash to wash the uncured resin from the surface of the part. How this is being done is by soaking the parts and moving them around into a solvent. So the solvent can be either IPA or TPM. For the purpose of this video, we are gonna be using IPA. Okay, so we remove the part from the wash. What we'll do next, we'll remove it from the build platform and put it through to the next stage. Now we'll open the door, place the part inside, close the door, and then we'll go into custom profile our part was printed into a clear resin, so we look for the clear resin down the list, found it, just press click, and this would tell us for how long the part is gonna be into the cure and at what temperature. So all we do now is press start. This is gonna start heating up to 60 degrees, and then the UV lamps are gonna come on and the part will be curing. Okay, so our part is now into the form cure for approximately 15 minutes. Once it's ready, we'll take it out and remove all the supports of the part. The great thing about Formlabs is the wide variety of resins available for different applications. In today's video, we're gonna to talk to you about a few of them. So we're gonna start with the first example, which is a draft gray resin. As you can see in this part here, 
The draft grey resin is used for concept iterations and to bring apart to market faster. If you're looking for a fast print, you could be using 200 micron setting, or if the part has fine details, you could be using 100 micron setting. Another resin is Rigid 10K, which is a highly glass-filled resin, and it's the stiffest in the Formlabs engineering materials portfolio. This material is suitable for industrial parts that need to withstand significant load without bending. It has a smooth finish and it's highly resistant to heat and chemicals. Another example is Tough 1500. We've got an example of part here. This is suitable for stiff and pliable parts that need to bend and spring back quickly. Another form lapse resin is Color Kit. So what the color kit is suitable for is for parts that require different colors. So what comes in the kit is a color-based resin cartridge, CMYK color pigments, which look like this bottle here. And also you get a syringe and a recipe book. So once you establish the color that you want to print it with, you would look at the recipe book with the syringe, take the color pigment out, put it into the color-based cartridge, mix it very well, and then it's ready to print. So some of the examples we have here is this particular part. We require the part to be printed in magenta. And also, if you have a part with different colors, what you can do, you can print the part separately and then assemble it together and you've got your part. As you can see in the video, the Form 3 range is a great printer for a small design office or even a large manufacturing company. The Form 3B, which is placed just behind me, is a great printer for running biocompatible materials for any medical applications. This printer also runs all the rest of the Form Labs resins. If you'd like to have more information or if you'd like to have any parts printed, we're going to leave our details in this video, so please get in touch with us, we'd love to hear from you. Thank you very much for watching this video and I hope you enjoyed it.